This is math 142, practice test number one, question number 12. We're supposed to sketch a graph of this thing. So uh, let me do a little analysis on this. Um, so I know that this one half, this has to do with the period. Uh, this is how fast it's going to start to repeat itself. And this one half is slowing it down. It's making it go slower. So it should take it a longer amount of time in order to start to repeat itself. So uh, thinking about that then, the usual period is 2 pi, and I'm dividing it by a half. Dividing by a half, the same as multiplying by the reciprocal of that 2 over 1. So 4 pi, so my period is 4 pi. So I know that it's going to repeat itself every 4 pi. Um, notice it's just a 1 out here, nothing. So its amplitude is 1. So it's still going to... Like if this is zero, it's going to go up one and down one, and it is in its in its extremes. But this plus four shifts, takes the whole thing and shifts it up four positions. So let's get a graph of this. So I'll, I'll deal with the period. Sorry about that. So it will start repeating itself after four pi. Half of 4 pi is 2 pi. Half of 2 pi is pi. So pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi. Great. Um, so then now, if it didn't have this plus 4 cosine, would start at 1, go through, and then go down to negative 1. But since it's 4, the whole thing shifted up 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There's 5 up there. So this thing, instead of starting at 1, starts at 5. And it kind of has this midline here. This, this would be the 0 at 4 if it, didn't, if it didn't have the plus 4 to it. So it starts there, comes down to 0, what would be 0, the midline, back to the lower extreme. That would have been negative 1. Um, back to that midline, back up to its extreme, and then back down. So then if I sketch it, it would look like that.